perspectives, as well as with international organizations, to provide rapid humanitarian assistance. It didn't take them really three or four days to get into Georgia, and it really shouldn't take them three or four days to get out. So I would expect them to begin an immediate withdrawal, which is their commitment. We want them to honor their commitment. Clearly, I think our, our allies in Europe and in NATO have seen those comments uh, shortly. NATO sent a firm message to Russia to immediately withdraw its forces to positions held prior to the outbreak of hostilities and honor its commitments. NATO also expressed its alarm about reports of Russia's deliberate destruction of civilian infrastructure and called Russia's actions disproportionate and inconsistent with its peacekeeping role. Disproportionate and inconsistent with its peacekeeping role. NATO stressed the urgency of switching to its original location as quickly as possible. But I think re reports are too sketchy um, right now as to the exact location of the American military equipment. Um, if the Russians have it, it needs to be returned immediately. And uh, there's some also uh, indications that they've made that assurance. Uh, if they've made that assurance, they need to honor that commitment as well. Results. I mean, some exercises have been canceled uh, between NATO and Russia.